to PLOS Video Shorts. This video is for our editorial board members who'd like to learn more about initiating a discussion in our submission system, Editorial Manager. Editors can initiate a discussion with their fellow editorial board members and the journal team throughout the whole editorial process. In this particular example, we will use a submission which is ready for associate editors' decision after review. You will therefore find your manuscript in the Submissions with Required Reuse Complete folder from the Associate Editor main menu. Look to the action links in the left-hand column of your manuscript and select the Initiate Discussion link. If there have been previous discussions on the submission, this link will appear as Discussions instead. This will open a pop-up window. First, enter your topic, which is synonymous to the subject line of an email, and then enter the body of your message in the field Initial Comments. You are now ready to select your participants. We recommend setting the display option to 250 results per page, sorting by editor role, and then searching the list using the Control F shortcut. Please check that the participants are available by taking a quick look at the Availability column on the right-hand side. Once you're ready to proceed, select your participant by marking the first tick box to the left, which will then automatically tick the following three boxes. This will ensure each participant can access the manuscript, reviews and draft decision letter. You can select multiple participants at this point although we ask you to ensure that you restrict your invitations to only the relevant editorial board members. We would also recommend always including a member of the journal team as well. Once you have selected your participants, click Proceed to Customise Letters in order to send discussion notifications. Please do not open a discussion by selecting Start Discussion Without Sending Letters as this will mean that participants are not notified of the discussion and you will not receive a timely response. On the following page, you will have the option to customise the discussion invite if you wish. This is not essential though, as the letter will be auto-populated with the link to the discussion forum alongside your initial comments. Once you're ready to proceed, click Confirm Selections and Send Letters. You have now set up your discussion. You can access this again by selecting Discussions from the Manuscript Action Links. Then click View. On the following page, you have the option to add a new comment to the discussion, add new participants, and view the materials associated with this submission. You will also be notified by email if a participant comments within the forum. Thanks for watching PLOS Video Shorts. For more information and for videos like this one, please visit our PLOS Media YouTube channel.